happy now that uh, it's, it's a lot easier in the commentary position. It is easier, especially watching bolts like that. So good second bolt from place, similar entry. So. Into her acro series, nailing that one. She's really concentrating here, getting every element of the routine right. So front aerial into a leap series. I think she was meant to connect that one, but just didn't quite get there, so she won't get the connection for that. She's a great competitor on this apparatus. You'll see some beautiful lines from her, starting with a difficult mount, front summy onto the beam. Front handspring into a front tuck, which you don't see a lot of gymnasts doing front uh, walkovers on the beam into a front summy, so good to see her trying something different. Complying with the code as well. We go back to the twisting machine of Kenzo Shirai. First attempt on the vault. Beautifully executed vault there by Kenzo. He's landing. See half turn, almost full turn onto the horse there. He's given the judges plenty to think about. And take off well. Absolutely. You can see tucking in, pulling into a really nice tight tuck there. You got to time that kick out well so that he can spot the floor and see it. And barely see over the horse as he comes down the bolt run. There's... Just so fluid, everything looks like a breeze and just makes it look all too easy sometimes. Nice aerial connections there. Front aerial into her split leap. Triple turn, nailing that one. Making it look easy as pie. See what's going on. It's hilarious. Look at him. Whee! Coming up to a dismount, double pike. Beautifully executed routine. Felga elements going through that basket hang there. Done beautifully. Some guys having to do elements in hang, in support. Also in that basket position with their legs close to their nose. Always starts with a solid first tumbling line here. The double layout. Nice and straight in the air, getting heaps of height there. Full in tuck. Just makes it look so easy getting all that height in her starting position. Triple twist to a punch front. Not sure if she got that all the way around, so we'll have to wait and see if the judges did pay that one for her. Don't know how she lucky how lucky she will be with that one minute. Mm. The double turn with the leg up. Again, that's a requirement that all the women must have in their floor routine is some kind of turn. Absolutely. You do. Surely it doesn't help the person who comes next if they don't like the honey. No, hence what you scrape it off and then <laughs> reapply it the way you like it. No, it does make it stickier, easier to hang on, especially when doing skills like that one, the felga. And it does give you a snack in case you're hungry in the middle of training. <laughs> magnesium and honey, not a great combination, <laughs> I have to say. I think you'd leave the magnesium <laughs> out, but... Shirai putting in a bit better performance than his counterpart Yamamoro before him. Big skills there. 
it's an element that they do judge you on, so you have to ensure that you're not only technical and you've got the difficulty, you can execute it, but you can show that you're having fun out there as well. So a nice tumble, two and a half into a front layout. Most of these names, or well, most of the names for these skills, he's just overcooked that one there. Some of his in bar work and a hop full turn. Long routine here. Unfortunately, not able to get himself into one of the qualifying spots there, but you mentioned the come off games. 405 days away is that, so he's a little bit of time to work on this high bar routine and the rest. release moves again very difficult to catch that second one in that in what we call the reverse grip say so definitely be the leader of the high bar competition currently the school will come through soon I'm sure Seems, certainly seems an interesting character. So the stoop through, and you see he changes that downswing a little bit. Hard release that one because you can't bring yourself too close to the bar because you've got to miss your feet, but then you've also got to grab it with your hands. At what point do you realise that you're not actually going to make it? About there. <laughs> that late? It is really late, yeah, because you reach out and you stretch. So Ahmed Onda here. Straight to catch up earlier, the straight to catch up with the half turn there. A very late turn there and just grasping the bar before the bottom of the swing. 